Whose Footprint Is That? by Darren Lund, illustrated by Kelsey Oseed. Whose footprint is that? It was made by two pointy toes. A mountain goat. A mountain goat has rubbery pads under its toes. It can climb a rocky cliff without slipping. Whose footprint is that? These are two footprints. They were made by hopping. A wallaroos. A wallaroo can hop as high as six feet. It can travel for miles without getting tired. Whose footprint is that? It was made by running on snow. A snowshoe hairs. A snowshoe hair has big feet. The feet keep the hair from sinking in the snow. Is that a footprint? It was made by slithering. That is not a footprint. It was made by a snake. Snakes don't have feet. They use their belly muscles to move. Whose footprint is that? It was made by standing in soft mud. A flamingos. Flamingos have webbed feet. The webbing keeps them from sinking in mud. A flamingo sleeps while standing on one leg. Clunk, clunk. Whose footprint is that? It is a fossil. It was made long ago. A dinosaur's. A dinosaur made its footprints in soft mud many years ago. Over time, the mud turned into rock. Whose footprint is that? It was made by a knuckle walking. A chimpanzee's. A chimpanzee stands flat on its hind feet. It uses its finger knuckles for balance when it moves. Can an animal change its footprints? Yes, a human can. Humans change their footprints by putting things on their feet. What made each footprint? The end.